Okay, I want to keep it on now. We are maybe less than two minutes. And it is getting very dark. Street lights are starting to come on. Really getting dark. At least with the clouds, I can take direct pictures, I can take direct video of the sun. Really getting dark. See how bright that is now. It's gonna keep this, it should be. Yep, it's coming. Any moment. There it goes. It's like evening. I can see the black disk of the moon, but unfortunately this isn't going to. And my smartphone is not gonna. You can kind of see the black dot. I can see it clearly, but the phone's not picking it up well enough. Now it's like nighttime. It's like about an hour after sunset at the level of the light. I'm going to pause this. Pause that for maybe 20 seconds, just to save a little bit. I wish this would show the, you can kind of see it there. Not as dark as I expected. Should be getting ready to come to an end. Let's look around. And there it is. That's the end of the eclipse. Well, the end of the of totality. The eclipse still has about another hour left, but that's the end of totality. And it's quickly getting bright again. It's almost looking like daylight compared to what it was just a bit ago. So well, you can't tell much of anything there. But I want to pause this. Still, it's just the tiniest bit of this, the tiniest little sliver of the sun that's uncovered. But just that tiny little sliver. And it's already back to pretty much daylight. Well, that's pretty much the show.
Hmm. That's pretty much the show. It's back to even with probably no more than 10% of the sun. That's probably no more than 10% of the sun that's even visible. 90% of it's still covered, but even with that, you're back to almost full daylight. So that's it.